my name is Kevin Joya. I'm a urologist uh, who specializes in urogynecology or pelvic floor reconstruction. Approximately 50% of women will suffer from some sort of a pelvic health disorder uh, in their lifetime and seek treatment for it. Some signs that you may be suffering from a pelvic floor disorder are uh, urine leakage when you don't want it to, uh, urgency where you can't get to the bathroom in time, uh, a bulging sensation vaginally, uh, problems with sexual activity, uh, sometimes it's just pain and sometimes it's a lot of uh, urinary tract infections. Treatment options for pelvic floor disorders really range uh, um, from very conservative, uh, for instance, sometimes it's just pelvic floor physical therapy, uh, to some small office-based procedures. Believe it or not, a lot of it is treated with diet and um, changes in your daily habit. Pain is really not as bad as you think it is. Uh, most patients are fine with just some Tylenol. Uh, they go home either that night or the next day, and I tell them to just take it easy. Just know, you know, I don't want them doing CrossFit and going to the gym for about a month. I like to uh, explain to my patients that this is quality of life surgery. It can be very uncomfortable to talk about uh, pelvic floor problems. Unfortunately, most of the women that suffer from them never get help because they don't seek the help because they're too embarrassed to talk about it. I urge those women to at least sit down and have a conversation because sometimes it's really not as bad as you think.